For most of its 50 years, the Stuttgart Ballet has been a major international player. Arts 21 looks at what keeps the company at the cutting edge of modern dance. There's a certain something in Stuttgart, but I can't put my finger on it. You could say this place has a particular magic. Of course there are ghosts. It's a haunted house. What Stuttgart has done for the world of ballet is incredible. And it all began with John. In 1961, celebrated choreographer John Kranke was appointed director. In just a few years, he turned the Stuttgart Ballet into a world-class company. And that legacy lives on. I think Kranko's magic is still here with us. John Kranko was not God. John Kranko was a fantastic choreographer. If it were possible, I would love to spend a day with John Kranko and find out what he thinks of his work today and what he thinks of the company now. What I consider important, and what John did too, is coming up with something totally new. This work by Christian Spuck is certainly that. I find that a work like Büchner's Leons and Lene is still amazingly fresh. In the production, we tried to make some links to the 21st century. So you have the over-the-top presentation and the way it makes gentle fun of narrative ballet. All the exaggeration makes a typical ballet something of a pantomime. So it teases traditional ballet a little. It's an old story, obviously, but what Spuck makes of it is new. Spuck's Leons und Lehn is better suited to our generation. It's funnier now than when it was written. At least, I find it funny. Doing ballet is not all fun, it's also hard work. The Stuttgart Ballet supports its dancers and demands a lot from them, too. Plus, it has a knack for finding new talent. When I met Christian, he was just starting out, but I felt somehow the boy had what it takes. And now Christian's becoming the director at Zurich. We're all very proud of him. I always believed in Marco and Christian. Marco Gurka, oh, avant-garde, wow. I had never seen anything like it in my entire life. We have to support this boy. He has talent. And yet, Interestingly, you can now see Marco all over the world. He gets so many job offers, he can't do them all. He is really in at the moment. But there's the it boy that's in the moment, huh? It would be awful if my choreography were just like Kranko's. It was thanks to Anderson that this work could be produced at such a classically oriented company. He made it possible. No one else would have done it in such a classical establishment. We just have to keep on creating. That's how we stay fresh and stay alive. And that's what we want to celebrate. It's not just the hundred people here tonight or the thousands who have come over the past 50 years who know us. We've been known all over the world for decades. We are somebody. Stuttgart has several stars. Mercedes is one and the ballet is another. 
In our world, the Stuttgart Ballet is a star, and it will always be a star in the ballet firmament. And it's always a star in our ballet firmament.